What's up guys? Okay, so people may have questioned in my last video why I like Transit. Now Transit deserves its own video just because of how big the map is and because of my own opinion on it. Please know that this is an opinion on the map. I'm fully aware most people hate this map and I'm going to try and explain why I personally love the map. With that being said, I hope you enjoy. On the 26th of September 2012, the Zombies game mode for BO2 was announced. The reveal showcased the map transit and the reveal got positive reviews from everyone in the Zombies community. The hype was high and so too was the expectations. Once transit was released, the overall reception to the map was positive. Everyone loved that there was a new zombie experience to play. It was only until multiple sources shed light on transit's flaws that the map's reputation started to decrease in both popularity and hype. Now I personally never jumped on the hate train with this map. Now don't get me wrong, Transit has a ton of flaws, but to me those flaws are minor to me, and most of them just make the map more fun. Now BO2 was my first Zombies game, and my first COD game in general, so I have to give it a little credit for getting me addicted to COD and to the Zombies as a whole. I first played BO2 in 2012, but I didn't get any form of DLC until around 2014. So I never played Mob of the Dead or Origins until around BO3 and BO4 times. So me having to play Transit for two years straight may have fucked over my opinions on Zombies map. But that's just a theory. Okay, you can do it now we're not doing this. Now I personally like Transit because it's just chaotic, but in a fun way. Now I was recording gameplay for the next video and I had to play Die Rise for the very first time. Now that map was also chaotic, but it was just too fucking chaotic, to the point where it was just not fun. In that map, I was scared to take a step as it would probably end me, but Transit doesn't kill you in bad taste. It does give you some breathing room. After you've gone through the chain of chaos, of course. Transit is also fun with friends, which makes it less chaotic because of the bus mechanic, and in some ways, the map is way more fun when you're part of the team. There's less stuff to do in time frames, but also I've seen people moan about the atmosphere. What I mean, during the Easter egg on the map Moon, the Earth kind of got hit by a fuck ton of nukes, so there are reasons for it. But also, the smoke is another issue people bring up. Now, smoke does actually have two purposes. One is to piss me the fuck off, and two is to make sure your game can, like, actually load. There's these little goblin things that jump on your head and fuck you. I don't know what they're called, but they're the reason the smoke shit just slows you down. It's a cool idea, but they do admittedly get annoying if you miss the bus. But if you never miss the bus, then it's all good. The tiny little fuckers don't pop out that much. The wonder weapon on this map, I've never used, nor seen it used, but other than in videos, from what I've heard, the wonder weapon is a bitch to construct. And breaks. But to be honest, I don't go out of my way to pick up uh, weapons of destiny or some shit. The only map I go out of my way to get a wonder weapon is Firebase C. But it does sound and look annoying to do. But I've never tried, nor will ever try. The boss zombie is an electric looking dude. I've only ever seen him twice, so either I'm super lucky, or I'm shit at the game. Probably just shit. But he shocks you and scares you on the bus. When you turn around, and that motherfucker be staring through the window asking for some sugar at your fucking left testicle. There's three locations which have survival mini games through transit. It has two extra exclusive locations, Diner and Power Plant. But Diner does have a cool turned game mode if you have the first DLC pack but no survival, though BO3 does have a custom workshop survival map for Diner. The power plant is just ignored by everyone, but the bus stops there, so I mean, it's location. But overall, I feel like Transit gets way too much hate, and I think some of this comes down to the hate train some of the community jumped on. But I encourage anyone who's watching this, that if you can grab one to three people, preferably don't literally grab them, but I mean, you do you and play some transit together. It's legit really fun, you'll be surprised. Transit is just good, admittedly it's not insane, but I wouldn't say it's anywhere near the worst. Nothing like Mob of the Dead.
Thanks for watching. I know this wasn't that long of a video, but thanks for getting to the end of the video. Personally, I'm not a fan of Mob of the Dead at all, which I will be explaining in a future video. The next video is a review on Die Rise, which I've never played before, so it'll be a first time review. So make sure to watch that when it comes out later this week. But with all that being said, I'll see you all later. Subscribe or I'll make you play transit.